Five reasons why the yuan will never replace the dollar. 1. China has no transparency. China has steadfastly refused to liberalize the yuan. Sure, Beijing wants its currency to go global, but it's also been careful to maintain financial stability. This stability is achieved through the use of capital controls. China controls how much foreign money can move in and out of its economy. This influences the foreign currency exchange rate. These controls are the reason China won't liberalize its current account. Beijing's market interventions make the yuan less attractive. The US dollar looks like a much safer bet. It has never been devalued. 2. China can't afford to run a persistent deficit. The dollar's position as a reserve currency comes at a cost. It creates a current account deficit for the US. The global demand for greenbacks exceeds the domestic demand for imports. These imports are likewise paid for in the dollar. As the global economy expands, demand for reserve assets increases. So the United States is always running a deficit. There are both upsides and downsides to this for America. But for China, such a position would be untenable. It's simply unable to run a sustained deficit. If global demand increased, yuan supplies would run out. 3. The Chinese middle class prefers to invest in America. The Chinese are getting wealthier, but this leads to a paradox. The middle class everywhere favors stability. The US dollar is still universally seen as the most stable currency. So those who can afford it invest in the American economy. American companies hold a significant share of the Chinese market. In 2022, China imported a record $40.8 billion of agricultural products from the US. All this further strengthens the American economy and the dollar. 4. Beijing needs the dollar as an alternative. Around 43% of all global payments are made in the US dollar. The euro is a relatively close second with 32%. The yuan accounts for about 3% of all transactions. That makes it the fifth most used currency worldwide, but its share in payments is paltry. The yuan's share in foreign exchange reserves is even less, at 2.5%. Meanwhile, USD reserves comprise 54% of all forex reserves. The euro accounts for another 20%. When it comes to reserve assets, the choice is limited. This is a problem for the Chinese central bank. To replace the dollar, it would have to hold its yuan-denominated bonds in massive amounts. 5. China won't be able to overcome global inertia. Markets resist change. No one really wants to switch to the yuan. China has promoted yuan use for international payments. But the biggest adopters have been authoritarian countries. Iran, Russia, and North Korea are happy to pay in yuan. But they have no access to dollars, euros, or pounds. The problem for China is what would happen if these regimes fell. Would a democratic and unsanctioned Russia freely choose the yuan over the US dollar? This issue scares away many potential adopters. The yuan is seen as a sanction-busting currency, but most economies would prefer to avoid sanctions in the first place.